Okay, just a quick video to show you how to change your settings. You may want to change inside your course in Schoology. Here on the home page of Schoology, you want to navigate to courses. And I've just got the one showing. And you probably have to do as well. What is probably important to avoid getting too much spam, depending on your point of view, is go to the notification settings here in the top right. This is the notifications for this course. And yours might be a little different since I'm the teacher of the course. But basically, you're going to get notified via email or possibly SMS, but it doesn't work here in Mexico that I know. Uh, course updates, if I send something that's an update to the course, or if there's comments on those updates or assignments or discussions, uh, comments on your own posts, you might want to have that separate to regular comments. Uh, a submission received, I think that's only for myself. Uh, user joining the course is probably only for myself. And course content created it would be something you probably want to um, have your students use during the regular classes um, when new content is created during the course but in this case I pretty much created all the content in the course but you might want to leave that enabled. Um, so there's that. The other thing you might want to look at is if you go to the Schoology help menu you can actually do that through um, the right click beside your name go to the help center and you can get information about anything to do with Schoology. One thing you might want help on is in your account settings and I've actually brought this up in the other tab. There's a link to the account settings. I just did a search on it. There's a help guide on your settings, how you can change your password, how you can integrate uh, multiple accounts in Schoology in case you have multiple ones, set your time zone, and so forth. 